just pulled up to the trap. You know what I'm saying? I let everybody get out how they feel about the whole situation and shit like that, about Knoxville and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? I let everybody get out how they feel before I spoke, man. I'm finna just talk my shit now. You know what I'm saying? How I feel about this shit. You hear me? Tune in, man. Share my shit. <clears throat> Just got to the trap. You hear me? I'm finna make this shit plain and simple. You hear me? Cause, cause, cause one nun street about this shit. You hear me? Wasn't nothing street about it. And I'm going to start the live out by saying, bro, I'm going to say what I'm going to say and speak my mind like a man. And at the end of the day, for the ones that know that I love them, the ones that know I love them, I still love you. And I and I care about your safety and I care about my family's safety. I care about, you know what I'm saying, innocent bystanders, motherfuckers that they have shit to do with this shit. This the same shit that just happened last time. Shirt this motherfucker, man. You know what I'm saying? That shit crazy, bro. You know what I'm saying? That shit lame as hell, bro. Nigga going on, nigga going on live and laughing and giggling and playing and shit like this shit some type of game or something. You hear me? This shit ain't no motherfucking game, bro. You hear me? Out of all the shows that y'all do, y'all wanna push on a nigga where my mama there, my little brother there. Ricky there. Come on, bro. You hear me? Come on, bro. If I was there, that shit wouldn't have happened. Because my security going to have security with them. If you my main man, I'm going to have a motherfucker on your security. I ain't going to let no motherfucker do nothing wicked in here. You hear me? Come on, man. The peace supposed to be at an all-time high, nigga. My mom in this bitch. Come on, man. Then nigga want to go live and nigga want to look hard by not posting nothing and like a nigga did something trying to prove a point. Man, that shit was weak as hell, bro. You hear me? Come on, bro. That shit was weak as hell, bro. Who you know doing that, bro? Ain't no nigga finna let no shit go down and they mama in this hoe, bro. My, I don't give a fuck if she was in the club, in the back, in the parking lot, none of that shit. Then you got my little brother, you got my little brother here, so if a motherfucker would have died, then who would have been crying? Me? You hear me? My motherfucking family? You hear me? These niggas that's doing all this shit, trying to show out and being a sin out like a motherfucker hard. Come on, cuz, you don't get no cool points for that, my nigga. I don't respect none of that shit that went down, my nigga. Cause my mama in that hoe, nigga. Fuck is you talking about, nigga? That's why I, that's why I be saying, bro. Nigga gotta know how to be a leader, bro, and move their team. Now, I understand, you say you booked the show on your own, right? So, boom, if you booked the show on your own, that mean that you paid a motherfucker to book they club out. This ain't even your record label moving with you. If that was the case, you would have been secured. You got a hundred thousand, you got motherfuckers spending hundred thousand dollars in security just so this won't happen, bro. Then you go lie to them out, a motherfucker put their arm around you. Show me one time a motherfucker tried to put their arm around you. You see what I'm saying? Come on, bro. If a nigga ain't up no scrap, if a nigga ain't rush towards you trying to harm you, come on, bro. Y'all ain't supposed to do none of that weak ass shit, bro. Then nigga be riding this whole yelling, talking about they chief and like they really moving like they supposed to. Come on, fool. Something. If my little brother would have died in that hole. Or if my mama would have got killed up there, then everybody wouldn't be laughing and playing. Going live, talking out, man, we did, did, did. Man, fuck all that shit, nigga. Tighten up, nigga. Fuck you talking about, nigga. Tighten up. Fuck you talking about. That's why a nigga don't want me around, period, bro. Nigga don't want little Trey around her. Because I would have smashed them nigga there with my brother. Fuck you talking about, bitch ass nigga trying to look hard. Trying to look like you riding. Nigga, what two times do he stood back in security, stood in front of him? He watched what happened. Come on, fool, I wouldn't have did that. Come on, fool, we finna smash. If I'm pumping you niggas up to smash, I'm finna smash with you. If that's the case, why he ain't do it? Because he cared about his life. He cared about his life. He cared about his freedom. So if I care about my life and my freedom, I'm going to care about my niggas' life and they freedom too. But these niggas don't care about that.
Happy New Year. Fuck a New Year. Fuck a New Year. Come on, man. Real talk, bro. This shit got me hot, bro. I can't hold it, bro. I can't hold it, bro. And I hope a nigga learn a lesson from me shit, bro. Come on, nigga. My mom in the club. My little brother here. Nigga, the peace supposed to be at an all-time high. Y'all want in motherfucking Baton Rouge or in Memphis where you got a thousand motherfuckers around you. Motherfuckers taking pictures of you, touching on you and everything, but you don't do nothing in them violent environments. You already said y'all was in a heat town, bro. These niggas ain't on nothing gangster, bro. They ain't on nothing gangster. What the fuck y'all risking the nigga family life for uh, to look gangster? That shit lame in hell, bro. Come on, bro. These niggas go live, bro, and don't make no type of point to the youth. You ain't make no point to the youth, bro. Then nobody get no understanding of what you were saying, bro. All you said was if a motherfucker play, you gonna smack him. Come on, fool. You can have a bitch ass nigga. You smack him, he'll kill you, fool. You think you gonna smack a nigga ass to the floor and a nigga don't do nothing? Come on, fool. It ain't gonna happen like that, fool. I just don't respect that, bro. And that's the same shit just happened last time. These niggas doing shit out of whack. Then when shit hit the news, Man, come on, man. Come on, oh, we good, we good, we good. Ain't nothing gonna happen for me. We up, we up, we up. But if a motherfucker would have died in that hoe, or I would have lost my mama, or lost my little brother in that hoe, motherfucker would have been laughing. Stupid ass nigga. Stupid ass nigga. You making all this money, you getting all this motherfucking bread from these shows and shit. But come on, for you doing a sign, understand though. If you trying to pay your little security, you know what I'm saying? You're trying to save money. Okay, if I got six bodyguards, I'm finna pay them two bands a piece. That's two, four, six, eight, ten. That's twelve racks. But now I'm gonna grab my own folk and damn near get them shit for them to crash the car and, and crash everything, bro. That shit lame as hell, bro. I don't feel that shit, bro. I ain't gonna cap, bro. I ain't gonna cap, bro. I let everybody get their words out, bro. And if a nigga ain't learning no lesson behind what I'm saying, fuck them. Nigga got a problem with what I'm saying? Fuck him. You hear me? Because at the end of the day, fool, it, it, come on, bro. I done seen this shit happen, bro. Nigga trying to prove that point on some group ass shit. Man, I swear to God, bro. Nigga playing this whole bro, on this thing, bro. On this thing. I'm bragging. I'm bragging. Nah, bro. This shit a domino effect, nigga. You do something, now the whole, my family got to deal with that. You nigga going to go home and have fun and laugh and giggle and talk about it. Come on, man. Not even my family. Everybody that I brought her. Come on, man. Come on, man. Then a nigga try to take off. I understand, bro. I, at the same time, yeah, like I said in my video, that out your respect. Don't let no nigga play with you. But at the same time, this is a different situation, bro. This ain't the streets, bro. You hear me? This business. We getting money, bro. Why the fuck we gonna do that and take the whole train down? Then a nigga go live and make it seem like they just King Tut or some motherfucker. Come on, fool. The internet shit lame as hell, fool. That's why I don't be on her. That's why I don't get on this hoe. Real talk, fool. That's why a nigga don't want me around them. Because I would have smashed them folks ass. Who swung first? Did a nigga pull a gun? Did a nigga try to fight, do anything? Come on, you beat. You beat. Come on, fool. Hey, that's how we getting down, but niggas ain't moving like that. Nigga be quick to chunk it up, but a nigga ain't moving like that. These nigga be bitches, fool. And I mean that, fool. My mama would have got hurt, or my little brother, even Ricky, would have got hurt in that whole cub. We would have been hurt behind that shit, nigga. It's the same shit just happening. You talking about, oh, man, man, it's business, man. I don't need no nigga putting their arm Show me one time the nigga put his arm around you. Come on, man. He was on some aggressive shit. I seen it in his face. He was talking to the nigga with the Gucci shirt on, trying to act tough and shit like that. He was close, but the nigga didn't try to put his arm around you, bro. Come on, bro. That was your, first of all, your, the first mistake was you let a nigga get that close to you. You took it up on yourself to get off the stage and get on the floor and sit down, bro. And these lame-ass niggas there with you that want to look good 
You in this hoe, you supposed to be on security. You in this hoe with a Gucci shirt on. You want to be seen. And the first nigga that take off fighting, if you security, why you ain't in this hoe suited and booted? You in this hoe with jewelry on, you laughing, playing, swinging your arms, smoking. You ain't no motherfucking security, bitch. Get up out of here. Come on, fool. Then the nigga with the Gucci shirt on, he, they done already, you see what I'm saying? I done already seen a nigga get knocked out. Instead of him helping him whoop the nigga that's on his feet, you go hit the nigga that's on the floor. Bam. What the fuck he gonna do? He on the floor. He dizzy. What the fuck he gonna do? Everybody take off trying to prove they point in front of these cameras. This shit lame as hell to me, man. And for a nigga to go live and talk like they talk and didn't make no point about it, I don't respect that, bro. Yeah, you, yeah, nigga probably, yeah, whatever happened, bro, whatever happened, happened. All I'm saying, nigga, the altercation had started. And what I seen a nigga do, it ain't about what nobody told me, nigga, I watched this shit. Come on, man, it's the same shit that's gonna, that's the same shit that's gonna happen, just like the last time. These bitch ass niggas wanna act like they riding and act like they they this, that, and the other gonna crash the whole fucking car, bro. All I'm saying, I ain't condoning that shit. That's why a nigga don't want me around, cause we gonna do this shit right. I don't give a fuck how much money it costs. Nigga, getting rich ain't that, it ain't that serious, bro. To risk a nigga life, bro, or for a motherfucker to lose a family member, bro. It ain't worth, the money is not worth it, bro. Real talk, bro. And nigga think, didn't nobody die, didn't nobody woo-woo, it's cool, we finna parlay. After I beat you bitches, we finna parlay. Fuck you talking about, nigga? Come on, man, you talking about a nigga got close enough where they can put their arm? Why the fuck he even this close to us? I supposed to be my men, they ain't supposed to keep everything away from me. Why the fuck this nigga this close to me? Period. Fuck her on. How the fuck he get up here? You niggas in the club playing. You niggas think this shit a game. Y'all ain't been through nothing. You niggas ain't had to do no time. Not for this shit. Nigga wanna look gangster, man. I'm only two times. Woo woo. Woo, last time I ran in the club. So this time I'm finna go on whoop a nigga, show a nigga I'm riding. I wanna show a nigga I'm riding. Man, if I was in that hole, my on my mama, I would've told them folk, I would've looked at him, I don't see no gun, he ain't swung at nobody, ain't security, get him up out of here. I don't give a fuck if he the po I don't give a fuck if he the police. The motherfucking club owner. I don't give a fuck. Get him out of here. Or we finna go, bro. It's dead simple, bro. Yeah, I posted him on my page. Yeah, bro, you did your thing, bro. Shine, shine, shine. Yeah, I'ma send you out too. Weak ass nigga. Come on, man. Yeah, I'ma send a nigga ass straight out too. Crash, nigga. Fuck you talking out. Come on, fool. Nigga, nigga wouldn't have let that went down, fool, if they mama was in there. If they had a little brother in there that they love, I don't know if you love your life or love what you do, but I love mine, homie. Real talk. Real talk, bro. I love mine, bro. And it's all fun and game. Everybody laughing and playing about this shit. Innocent people. You see what I'm saying? Come on, bro. The peace supposed to be there at an all-time high, my nigga. Everybody in there knew my mama was there. They knew my little brother was in there. They knew my brother was performing. So your first man is, we finna take off. We don't care about if these folk get, get richer or if these folk come out successful. Or, we don't give no fuck about that. I just want to show two times I'm a gangster. Get your bitch ass out of here. Now. Now, it's a hole in the wild club because, because nigga trying to get their money, fool. And I understand that, fool. I understand. I understand all that. What I'm saying is, it ain't worth it. Fuck all 
all that shit. Fuck the club. You see what I'm saying? It's not worth what y'all did, bro. And y'all get on this whole plan and parlaying and laughing and giggling like this shit some type of game or something, fool. I don't respect that shit, fool. Come on, fool. This shit all over the blogs. My mama was there. That mother was trying to put a robbery chart. I understand if the nigga played first. Yeah, I already read a smell. You said you jumped out the sprinter. You looking for the nigga. You already mad, bro. So your team picking up on this. Your team picking up on this. You hear me? Usually you will have one nigga that's with you that got the right type of mindset, fool. You will have one nigga with you. Hey, bro, hell no. This shit petty as a motherfucker. We get money. This hick ass town, man. These folk. These folk lame, man. It ain't no. Ain't no real gangsters in here. Like, it were white folks in the front. Hold on, man. Hold on, man. Come on, man. You got white folks in the front of the club, bro. These folks came here to see you, bro. You don't care about your reputation, bro. Didn't none of these niggas get smashed when y'all got back to the spot, bro? That's on God. I know they didn't. You gave a nigga they trophies. That shit lame, bro. What a respect here, bro, for my mama, bro. Or my little brother, bro. I used to be the same nigga, bro. Beat nigga with pool sticks and eight balls and you see what I'm saying? Hit nigga that across the head with the ball and all this shit. I don't get no credit for that. I'm walking out the door. Motherfuckers still shooting. I don't get no credit for that shit. We didn't feel that shit. And I wasn't going to go on the internet until I seen it hit the internet. The facts is out there. Now, I'm going to say what I'm going to say. If you don't like it, fuck you. Because a nigga don't care about me and mine. Nigga don't care about my family. Nigga don't care that my mama was in the area or my little brother was in there. So, fuck you. You and this bitch with Gucci shirts on and shit. You bitch you wanna act. You bitch you wanna have fun. This shit ain't no motherfucking gang around here, nigga. My brother lost five years of his life for the same shit. I don't give a fuck what happened or who did it. All I'm saying is, bro, where I seen the wrong get, bro. And I don't respect it. Period, fool. That's why a nigga don't want me around, fool. Cause a nigga not gonna kill me. And a nigga not gonna fight me. Cause I'm I been knocking shit out. Come on, fool. Nigga ain't gonna rush me like that. Period. Period, fool. Come on, fool. I just spazzed on a nigga ass on IG. You hear me? When I know he right, man, I'm supposed to say gonna go to the feds. You hear me? Fuck who did it or what happened. It happened dirt. My brother name on the flower, bitch. That shit's supposed to be at an all-time high. The peace. Supposed to be at an all-time high, bro. We dealing with that shit, bro. Nigga too strong for that. Nigga done been through too much. Hey, look, bro. First of all, when we get back to the spot, bitch, you beat. You beat. You beat. Now, I might want to keep you around after this. But, bitch, my mama was in there. My little brother was in there. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. Look, you. If you ain't does in that shit, you was wrong, bro. I love my brothers. I love my family. Fuck these new niggas. I don't care nothing about these niggas. If you gonna say it's business, keep it business. Stop keeping it cool with these niggas and fucking with it. Ain't no nah. I respect what you said, bro. But stand on that shit, nigga. If it business, let a nigga know it's business, bro. Real talk, bro. And if my mama would have died in that hoe, nigga, you would have been ready to kill everybody, nigga. I don't give a fuck if she was in the back, the front. I don't give a fuck if she was across the street, nigga. My mama in the area, nigga. How the fuck we not thinking? All this money. And a nigga want to do something to take the whole car down. Once again. Even if it's a fight. Any type of altercations. We not arguing with no nigga talking. Doing none of that shit. We ain't doing no confrontations. We ain't doing no confrontation. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing going on. Listen. Hey, bro. Hey, listen. Hey, bro. Hold on. Hey, DJ. Hold on. Stop this motherfucker. Hey, security. Grab him. Get him out the way. Hey, look, man. I'm finna still rock my shit. I'm finna get up out of here. My these boys in here wildin'.
It's simple, bro. Nah, but you done pipe these niggas up. Nigga already sent out. So you now already pipe the nigga up. That's why I say, bro, you got to be a leader, bro. You got to let niggas know, hey, bro, this plan A, B, C, and D, bro. No, but now you, man, I'm ready to smash these niggas, man. I'm telling ready to take a nigga head off playing with me. Real talk. You know what I'm saying? They don't know my brother. That's why I'm saying niggas don't know my brother, fool. So niggas don't know how to cope with him. They will come with new niggas. They don't understand that he got a mental problem. When I'm not around and shit like that, I ain't tripping. I still support him and I love him because I know he got a mental problem, bro. At one moment, he cool the hell. The next moment, he clicking. Why she laugh? He humble for a second. Then he spazzing out. You see what I'm saying? I understand that he like that. So I know how to deal with him. And he'll listen if you dig it through him. But his first mind is going to be like that crash. Bitch played. Fuck him. You hear me? The bitch played. The bitch played. The bitch played. Fuck him. You know what I'm saying? But if a nigga take my life and go sit down somewhere and watch my shit and feel some type of way, you supposed to, nigga. You supposed to, nigga. I feel some type of way, nigga. Come on, man. Come on, man. I hope you learn from this. Hopefully, don't nothing come back from it. But all I'm saying is, bro, once again, these bitch ass niggas, because get what? At the end of the day, I used to be, man, I used to be routed up about a who, man, who, man, who did that? What happened? Who did it first? Man, on God, hey, bro, I love you, bro. That's my brother, bro. You hear me? I appreciate you for protecting. Woo, 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 woo. I love you for that, my nigga. Yeah, I got something for you when I see you. You see what I'm saying? But now, man, after all this shit we done went through, all this pain and all this, come on, bro. We probably, me and my brother probably wouldn't be separate right now if it weren't for his sinners, bro. You see what I'm saying? That shit separated our whole family, bro. Do you know how much shit we went through in them five years, bro? Do you know? Then if my little brother would have died in there, who would have been holding my mama, bro? Me. He the most innocent young nigga in there. Now he gonna go now. Look, you gonna go now. Don't don't let that. He the only nigga go watch the video. My little brother, the only nigga that's standing in there like this. He the only nigga that ain't saying nothing, moving, doing nothing. He ain't causing harm to nobody. The bitches love him. Oh, he got his little brother right here. Boom! And knock my little brother down in there. Who would have been holding my mama, nigga? Me. So I'm really ready to smash you nigga behind that fool. Real talk, fool. I don't care nothing about a nigga, man. That's my little brother. Don't do nothing to him. Do it to me. Because I'm going to do it to you. Real talk, fool. Real talk, fool. Y'all can go do that cowboy ass shit somewhere else, fool. Y'all can do that cowboy, that cowboy ass shit somewhere else, fool. You hear me? Nah, I can't have him. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Nah, we ain't gonna. My little brother, he do too much, bro. I ain't here now. Here now. We gonna do this shit ourselves. My little brother ain't gonna. He gonna do too much. Yeah, nigga, I'm forever gonna do too much, nigga. I'm forever gonna do too much, nigga. We done been through too much, nigga. And ain't no nigga finna reap the fruits from nothing, nigga, that I done been through all this pain and shit I done been through. Nigga, if it's business, nigga, keep it business with a nigga, nigga. You talking about you keeping it, keep it business and, and you doing the opposite. Come on, man, I understand all the tough ass shit and all the rough shit. I understand all that, fool. You hear me? But this the internet, fool. I don't be believing none of that shit, fool. Come on, fool. Ask about me, fool. Come on, fool, these niggas fall and hit the ground, nigga, get back up, ready to fight again. That my ass was out of there. Rumble, nigga. You done started the fight, nigga, rumble. When the whole time, this supposed to be your right hand man, yo, he supposed to say. Nigga, you supposed to be on my brother ass with security. Making sure, yo, you know what I'm saying? Making sure they all right, what's up? You supposed to be in bro face too. What's up, bro? You straight, right? It going down back there, you straight, bro? We, let, come on. Let me make, make sure brother done right. I'm finna get you up. But you want to... You want to look hard. You want to look like that nigga. And you want to act tough and take off on a nigga when not knowing my family in this whole nigga. It's war when them hands get the thumping, nigga. It's war now. Anybody can die or anything, nigga. Oh, they go hit him. There he go. Hit him. Hit him. Hit him. Quick. 
But ain't nobody gonna speak on it. We gonna stay quiet. Ain't nobody gonna speak about this though. We ain't worried about this. We don't care nothing about two time. We don't care nothing about his mama, his little brother being there, his business, his career, how far he done came, all the risks he done took getting off that jet. And all the shit we done been through, all the pain, the tears, the sentencing. Nigga, I was at the sentencing, nigga. I know who was there. That nigga wasn't there. Wasn't none of these niggas there. You showing all these nigga faces and shit like that. I don't mind. Listen. Nah, I'll bring my little brother. Nah, my little nah, I can't have my little brother around. Oh God, nigga, I'm constructing shit, nigga. I'm constructing that shit. Real talk, bro. I said what I had to say, bro. It's simply that, bro. Real talk, nigga, feel how they want to feel about how I'm coming, bro. But at the end of the day, bro, if I would have lost my foe, bro, a nigga wouldn't have even said rest in peace to my mama, bro. These bitches on here that's talking to me, his mama took this or took... I want third. I don't know. I just know my mama not that type of person. It had to be some... We having money. It had to be some that went on wrong and my mama got there trying to construct some shit. You see what I'm saying? That's what happened. If y'all owe a motherfucker or something like that, it had to be something like that. I know. Come on, fool. A robbery. Why y'all know y'all got cameras in there? Show where they walked in with some scraps and demanded some money from y'all, bro. Then you want to blame the promoter. How the fuck you gonna blame him? The problem that y'all having is business. Y'all supposed to step in the back one on one and walk to the back and talk about the leadership, bro. This shit gonna save a whole lot of pride. Why y'all wanna do this shit while my family in there, bro? You hear me? Bro, you took out behind the nigga. The nigga not even talking to you. You see what I'm saying? The nigga not even, I understand you want to ride and you want to show a nigga you hard and you know how to fight. The last junk you tripped on the stage and didn't nobody get their ass beat. I would have respected that better, bro. I ain't going to need that. If you would have stood down in that hole and it wouldn't have happened, I would have respected that more, bro. Even if my mama went in there, bro, we done been through too much shit, bro. And niggas won't let me around so I can't speak my voice, bro, and try to construct no shit. Because I ain't got nothing but an opinion. We men, bro. Niggas can do what they want to do at the end of the day. Move how you want to move. Keep on doing it, bro. That's why I said, bro, these bitch-ass niggas that come around a the nigga, these niggas is not on the business, bro. Yeah, it's a real security might snitch. They might tell something, woo -doo -woo -woo. these niggas might run and do all that. All these niggas possess the same thing. If it's a, a legit security or it's a nigga that so-called supposed to be street. I ain't nothing street about that, bro. Now, if a nigga would have got close and upped the knife or a nigga would have swung at my brother, now, now, you see what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? These words and all that shit ain't finna move me, bro. My nigga ain't talking about shit. My two tell you a bitch or this, that, or the other. Woo, woo, woo. My that shit ain't nothing. Perform. 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 You hear me? Don't move. Nobody move. Perform. You hear me? Now let's go. You see what I'm saying? Now we hear a That's a different story. If a nigga got a duck or a nigga that threw something and reached, uh, that's a different story. That man didn't even reach at you, bro. That man stood close by a nigga that came in and was talking to a nigga in their face like a man. Whatever he was saying, whether he was disrespectful or not, you doing your show, ain't nobody harming you, bro. But you want to get on this hoe, and I don't understand, man. I understand that this internet shit, if motherfuckers go off of it, motherfuckers believe it, some motherfuckers don't. You see what I'm saying? Motherfucker gonna keep they shit online and say all that while I post it. And say what I... Call me, man. Call me, man. Call me, man. Call me, man. Don't call me no more. I'm on live. That's why motherfucker doing that shit, bro. Come on, bro. Like, come on, bro. Come on, man. Come on, man.
That's how you know motherfuckers don't get no fuck about you, bro. Nigga don't get no fuck about your success, bro. You hear me? Now understand if something go wrong, a nigga supposed to do what they gon' they came in with you. But who gon' think right? Who gon' have the right type of mentality, bro? Who gon' do this shit right, bro? This shit lame, bro. Give a fuck what no nigga say. And like I said, fool, a nigga don't like what I'm saying, fool. When you see me, hit me in my mouth, fool. Hit me in my mouth, fool. I'm still the same nigga, fool. Yeah, I did would have went down like that. It's going down. I would have rolled. I would have prevented it first. But if it went down, I would have rolled. Bro, you went by. You was on this side. You went behind a nigga back, fool, and went and did some shit. Then a nigga would have pop, pop. You hear me? You ain't got nothing on you. You fighting a security guard. For that man could have killed you. Nigga would have been sick. But get what? Two times safe. Two times don't know where his mama or his little brother at. All he sees is security in front of him. Because you done took off and did. Jumped off stage. Bumped the nigga. If he wanted, you think he... If that was the case, he would have fired on the nigga. He close enough. Jump off the gun and fire on his ass. If that gone, crash the car, bro. Over some broke ass, lame ass nigga, nigga stuttering and I watch the nigga lie. The nigga stuttering and everything, bro. These nigga lame, bro. What type of point we got to prove? We getting money. Fuck, we got to prove. Ah, uh, no love word don't mean nothing. She ain't with them. He ain't, he ain't, he ain't reaping. He ain't reaping nothing. He ain't doing. He ain't, he mad. No, he he mad because he ain't with them. He mad because. They said he ain't F and G no more. Look how you sound, fool. Look how you sound, fool. Then my family, fool. This shit bigger than the money, the success, all that, fool. I lose my, any one of my brothers. Or I lose my mama behind this shit, fool. I'm going on a fucking rage, fool. I'm going to be the first thing smoking early in the morning, fool. Get your coffee, fool, because I'm on everybody's screen, fool. I don't know if a nigga going to die by me like that, fool, but can't nothing happen to my family, fool. And everybody, the innocent that went through that, bro, come on, bro. These folks got families they going back home to. These folks love you, bro. These folks got families they going home to, and they got to go home and tell their mama or their daddy, Shit, we went out and woo woo woo, and this happened. Besides the folk that got hit, it, it hit your man. Hit your man, fool. In the head. Hit your man. If you gonna go there, cause that's what a nigga gonna do to us. Oh, uh, there go his folks right there. There go his folks. Boom, boom. There go his little brother. Boom, boom. That simple, fool. Over what? Over what? It wasn't about no real money. Ain't nobody died in her money. She was some free lame ass shit, fool. Yeah, I ain't gonna be around. I'm not gonna be around, fool. I'm not. Because this shit gonna go different. You hear me? It's gonna go different, bro. Nigga don't get no credit for that. If anything, I'm gonna get on there and say my condolences. I don't know what happened, man. It got ugly. And woo 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 woo, -woo. And, I, and I apologize for what it, but you don't, you don't want to do that. Because you got so much anger and pain and shit built up in you. You done done all them years in jail looking at the wall. You got something to prove. You mad. You angry. You aggressive. You don't give a fuck about nobody. You in survival mode. All you know is get rich. Then when somebody die, hopefully maybe you'll wake up then. Whether it's family or it's one of your partners. Maybe we'll wake up. Fuck it. Let's just move how we want to move. Let's let 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 let's just be gangster, bro. Everybody that disrespect us, let's smash them. Everybody that got a word to say, or oh, 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 let's smash them, bro. Period. Let's smash them. Now, nah, matter of fact, call Mom Deuce up. Tell her to hit the road with us, and we gonna go in here and while she here, we gonna smash them. All oh, you nigga lying in hell. That what I be meaning, bro.
I really woke up on this shit, fool, because I had a nightmare, fool. I had a nightmare, fool. See what I'm saying? I try my best to keep it cool, bro, and smile, bro. I can't because I sit around and look crazy. Then when it's a funeral, now a nigga got something to say. Now everybody saying, damn, shit, if this wouldn't have happened, if that, how did this happen? Now everybody investigating it. But a nigga want to look gangster. Bro, this shit already set in stone, bro. Nigga know you going to pull something. Nigga know you know how to fight, fool. But what about this career these folks just gave this man and all this money and shit, fool? What about my mama not never crying no more, fool? You don't care about that. My little brother is golden in the family. He the baby. He's the youngest one, fool. I'm going to fucking lose it, bro. They probably getting them props. I ain't look you, you. Lil Ju, you. I would have been right there with him. Yeah, Lil Ju, you did. Bam! And fired on the nigga ass. Get your bitch ass out of here. For playing with this campaign like that. Come on, fool. I ain't mind. Listen, bro. Nigga don't want me around. This the only way I can voice my opinion, bro. Maybe a nigga call me, it'll be different. But I'm going to be watching, fool. I'm going to be watching, fool. And I'm going to speak my mind, fool. That why nigga, I, I ain't used to be like this. Why I used to jail. Say no more. We finna go kill a nigga ass. Let's go. You heard me? That's the type of mentality I had. So I went to go sit down, fool. Yeah, nigga done more time than me. I ain't did number 13 months. But I had to think about everything that went down and how this shit happened and what's next. Like, how can I prevent this shit? Like, Fuck the money, fuck the gangster shit. I'm laying in my cell, I'm hearing my mama crying. Like I hear a voice in my head, fool. All the situation, fuck him just getting sentenced. All the situations that we done been through, my mama crying, that's all I hear in my head. Now she happy, my mama smiling. My mama going to get her hair done every day. She on Facebook popping her shit. My love you, ma, I swear to God, can't nothing happen to you. You hear me? I swear to God, especially about these bitch-ass niggas, bro. You hear me? Because if he was in that hole by himself, he did what he supposed to do. Them motherfuckers get to doing what they doing, he still back. The security stood in front of him. How many bodyguards like the big nigga that was in front of you? How many of them bodyguards that's there, bro? Because if that's the case, it's supposed to be a bodyguard on you, the other nigga, that the groupy nigga, the nigga that wanna act like he hard and wanna show a nigga he gangster and show a nigga I got your back and all this shit. But when a nigga dead, yo back in that dirt, my nigga. Yo back on that bump and that bitch hurt. My shit still hurt, still be popping this shit. That's from laying on my shoulder on a on a hard ass bump, pulling the motherfucking cotton out the. Put out this thin ass mat. I'm putting the cotton out the mat, wrapping it in a sheet, tying a knot on it, laying my head on it. That bitch feel like a rock. That bitch feel like a rock. Niggas don't want to talk about that though. Get what? If a motherfucker would have died in that hole, you niggas would have been crying like some bitches. You niggas would have been crying like some bitches. Oh, I ain't say no. Nah, I, I, my shit, it went like that. That nigga won't die, don't want to post nothing. You done did some shit out of whack and ain't going to say nothing. You ain't going to post nothing on your page, but you ready to fight a nigga. You ain't going to post and say condolences or this was the reason why I did what I... Man, talk to the youth, bro. Talk to these people, bro. Get these folks mind right. I, don't, I ain't going to say I give a fuck about everybody. I'm speaking about mine and I can't get my voice out. Nigga, know I love my brother to death. You hear me? I hate I ain't third with him because I know I'm on your ass. Not aggressively, just opinion-wise. Man, look, bro. Brr, 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 brr. He don't want to hear that shit. He feel like his mood is the way to go. This what he want to do. That what you want to do. Say no more, bro. It's, it's been times where 
I look up to my brother so much because it's been times where we didn't did shit that was wrong and I didn't understand it. But once we got through it, I got more respect for him. I was like, all right. So that's where I got that side out of me. He brought that side out of me where I'm going ham and not thinking about the consequences. Like I said, bro, I got both sides, bro. I know how to be gangster and I know how to be humble, bro. I was baptized at 12, bro, 13. The lady that baptized me right there at by Sheffield at the goddamn, I think it's Olivet Church. She died in a car wreck, bro. They were my basketball coach. She came to my house and knocked on the door and told my mama, come on, we finna go baptize him out by myself. Jumped in the back of her truck. No folk baptized me. I come out the water. Woo! My mama in the stand laughing like, boy, that boy crazy. So I got some type of blessing on me. My brother done did so much time. He colorblind. He don't see number green. Number green, bro. You know what I'm saying? But it hit a motherfucker when they walk in that motherfucker and they slam their door behind you. And you looking at them motherfucking brick walls and this motherfucking gate where you can only see this part of the yard. You can't even see the sun. The sun all the way over there. You just see this. Or a motherfucker dead man in that casket. Body cold. Hands stiff. I can't see man like that, bro. So everybody, bro, that was in Knoxville, bro. Man, you know what I'm saying? Man, if you watching, if you don't watch, man, you hear me? I feel bad for that situation. Because business got personal. And these niggas don't really know my brother like this. So they don't know how to stand on him. See what I'm saying? Respectfully, though. Hey, bro, you wrong. What you doing? You ain't thinking about, brr. You ain't thinking about, brr. Oh, so it's, so, everything you just did, so fuck it. Get rich or die trying. I know you, I know we used the love 50 cent and shit when we were young. You jumping out the bunk bed and shit, bumping 50. You know what I'm saying? I understand that shit, fool. But at the same time, I'm not saying pipe down. All I'm saying is, bro, use your mentality and think, bro, before some shit get out of way, bro. I hate to see that happen to you again, bro. Because guess what, bro? It ain't, it ain't just these niggas making decisions that's just that's going to hurt not only me or him. This shit a domino effect, bro. Y'all seen them pictures with all my cousins and shit. Everybody happy for what's going on right now. You see what I'm saying? Niggas think I'm posting. Niggas think I'm posting a video trying to stunt like, yeah, we gangster. Come on, fool. Nigga think I'm posting it for that reason. Come on, fool. Hell no. Nah. I posted it so I can show motherfuckers the facts. Yeah, everybody don't want a nigga that's going to... Man, listen. These niggas so grouped out and so lame. Any nigga going to ride for you and die and go to jail and do a life sentence for you when you get rich. Anybody. Anybody, fool. So what make these niggas special? Because when nigga take the car down, now you call and crying, man, tell this nigga, man, these nigga, this hurt happened, woo, woo, woo. But then not happen, everybody good, then nobody die. Them folks ain't never nigga dope beating this hoe down. Now everything cool, let's go live and talk about nothing. Smack a nigga ass to the floor. All this shit entertainment, bro. So, you know you ain't finna do that shit. Or you gonna have somebody that's right there with you ready to protect you. You hear me? Because what man ain't gonna be a bitch-ass nigga? If he got a gun and you smack him, cuz he gonna kill you. If any nigga put their hand, they gonna kill you, fool. I ain't even reading the comments, fool. All this shit just on my brain. Like I said, bro, I just had a nightmare last night, bro. That ain't the only one that I done had, bro, that I got a bite. Wake back up and still promote this shit. I don't get no fuck about this shit. I love my family, bro. I'm the nigga that's gonna pull up when it's a problem. I ain't sending no money. I'm putting up on you. Look at you in your face. What's going on? What a problem, man. This how we finna solve it. They play again, dump. 
You heard me? Oh, you out of bullets? Come on, we're gonna take you go get some more. Hollow tips, huh? Huh? I'm going back out of town. I'm, I'm back in the cut. You heard me? Under some soft. You heard me? I love my life, bro. I ain't missing nothing, bro. I ain't chasing nothing, bro. I have my weight, bro. I got everything I ever wanted, bro. You see what I'm saying? I can't do nothing but go up, bro. I love my life. I'm 27. So if a nigga don't like me, this why. Woulda, coulda, shoulda. Damn, it coulda happened down. What if it woulda happened? What if a motherfucker did die? My heart already broke, bro. I can't take no more, bro. I even would have felt sorry for it if an innocent bystander or anybody would have got I can't take no more, bro. That's why I want to get this shit up. Motherfucker barely liking my clothes on this hoe because they, they want me to rap. They want to see me do that, but I want to do something different, bro. I'm tired of gangsta shit lying to me now, bro. And I still whoop a nigga ass, bro. You hear me? So, I go in the store. I'm going to tell you how I experienced it. I go in the store to promote my clothes. I know y'all seen a video where I gave a nigga the bag and shit like that. I'm going to tell y'all how this shit work. So, I go in the joint. I give him the bag. The nigga set the bag on the counter and open it up. Once I start recording, a nigga came from the back with some blue shoes on and a blue top. He was a light-skinned nigga. He looked like he was Mexican, but he still was black. The nigga had a long ponytail in his head. And he had an accent like he was from Cali. So he was like, he was like, damn, thug, that's all you got is a red one? He not knowing. As he got up on me and seen my tattoos and shit, he asked me about my clothes first to see if I'm a real gangster. Like, so I'm looking at the nigga in his eyes. I'm, I ain't think he owned nothing because he just asked me about my clothes. He like, damn, bro, that's all you got is a real one? He asked me so many times, that's all you got is a real one? So I'm picking up on what he's saying. So he like, man, all right, man, let me know when you get a blue one. He currently trying me. He like, you affiliated? I'm like, no, because I'm here about some green. You nigga, you, you, you weak ass guy ain't banging that ass nigga. I'm here about some green. You see what I'm saying? So what's the point of me trying to prove to this nigga who I am, what I done done, and that I break this nigga jaw right here? But I had to keep my cool. I couldn't even, I couldn't even let it get verbal. You see what I'm saying? And it's hard to do, bro, when you know you a gangster and you know this nigga a bitch. Then he's standing right there. He got gold glasses on. On the side of his glasses, he got a little tape on it. Come on, man. You junk as hell. Then he asked me to guess his age. I'm like, bro, you about 45, bro. He like, man, now nah, I'm 43. He's standing with his legs open. He's standing with his, I'm, I'm 43. So I'm like, damn, you don't see all the other red clothes in it? You don't see all the other red clothes in this hole? You know what I'm saying? He ain't got nothing to say about that. I'm like, man, say no more. I held my baby. I'm under pressure, man. Under my own pressure. Because I'm ready to whoop this nigga. You hear me? And put him and go across his head. You hear me? But now nah, I'm like, I'm like, think. Use your mind. You've been through too much for this. Don't do it. Don't do it. So I still got to communicate. He like, man, look, whatever you're going to do, man, make sure you come back in this motherfucker with some blue, man. I'm like, all right, OG. Say no more. I got you. When I get a blue one, I'm going to come save that bitch. I'm going to get you a discount and everything. You see what I'm saying? Y'all got to know how to curb these niggas, man. Come on, Brandon. I'm by myself. You see what I'm saying? So I beat a nigga mentally. Me back when I was 21, 22. Who you talking to, fool? Soon he say you, I'm gone. You see what I'm saying? It's laughs and giggles now. It's laughing and playing now. Everybody, once again... We gangsta again, all right. All right. You gonna go up on show for some shit you could have prevented. Some shit that you could have stood on, bro. I'm gonna forever be your brother, bro. I love you, bro. And all I'm saying is, bro, every time you better, you better move right. 
Because then what's going to happen, bro? I'm going to say what I'm going to say, bro. I know you don't like it. Man, my little brother talk too much, man. He, he be doing too much, man. I ain't fucking with him, man. He, he, he done lost his mind. Now, you done lost your motherfucking mind, bro. It's the same shit my granddad will say to you if you go sit down on the table, sit down at the couch with him. He gonna run your ass down. You ain't gonna get mad at him and say, fuck him. I beat that bitch. Well, I do this or do that. And it ain't even to that point. My brother ain't saying nothing bad about me. He ain't. But this shit by you constantly dealing with this nigga, dressing like this nigga, and, and trying to, you see what I'm saying? Go on, send him out there and hang him. Get him a chain and hang him then. All I'm saying is, protect yourself. You know what I'm saying? Protect my little brother. Protect your campaign. Protect your business to the utmost. I don't give a fuck how much it costs. Spend two hundred thousand in security. Don't I don't know. They they might don't even motherfucker might don't even call me after this. I don't give a fuck. Everybody want to ride with the nigga that's getting the money, that's getting rich. Don't nobody want to stand on nothing. It's just whatever he do, cool. Now, I would have promoted my phone one third. I would have promoted that shit and I would have left it alone, bro. Soon I heard and I watched the news once again. I'm watching this shit again. I don't give a fuck what happened. All I know is it could have been prevented. Y'all got me and this whole sweating and everything, man. We don't need that type of shit, bro. That shit kill money, bro. That shit kill money, bro. Motherfucker scared to deal with a nigga, bro. This, this ain't no good publicity, bro. One of these niggas that you talking bad about, a nigga that's supposed to be a op, go smash on one of these bitch ass niggas. Go smash somebody else and record it. Don't do it while my brother around you. Don't do it while my folks around y'all. What type of respect and love do y'all got for this campaign and for my family? None. So fuck you niggas. And I been on it. Because I realize you niggas groupies. Crash dummies. Jabronis. Cornball ass niggas, man. Now my motherfucking live block. I won't go live on IG. My motherfucking live block. Because I post a picture to me, I don't tolerate no disrespect. And I ain't tolerate no disrespect. That's disrespectful to me, bro. I would have rolled, but when we got back, I would have beat one of these folk. When y'all gonna stand on that? All right. 85. I'm gonna say what the fuck I wanna say. I take her myself. Handle my own business, bro. Don't no nigga look out for me when it's war. It's time for me to run, walk around, move around these violent environments, hustling by myself. I do all this shit. Nigga, I watch over my own back. And like I said, nigga, been not fuck with me. It's simple. Nigga, been not fuck with mines. Now, that little small shit, we can let it pass. Little fights and arguments and beefing and we can let this shit pass back, bro. We've been doing this shit for years, bro. Getting the house about the police. Get down on you. Get down. We done, did, we done been through that. Nigga want to fight. Brrr, we gone. Wipe a nigga face. Keep moving. There ain't nothing. You see what I'm saying? But a nigga got to get older, bro. A nigga got to get to a point where a nigga got to wake up at some point, bro. Nigga 30 years old, bro. Everything on the line, on the line, bro. And it just to show y'all, bro. Niggas on here laughing, bro. They on here laughing. These folks don't get no fuck about no nigga. But I can't make my point. I can't make my point without a person 
Black sheep, black sheep. We don't want them around. He don't know nothing. He don't know. Everybody know how I'm coming, fool. You can't paint no picture on me or who I am. Ain't nobody gonna believe you. Man, I see what I see, man. And I'm gonna leave it there, bro. Real talk, bro. Y'all think this shit a game. Y'all think this shit something to, something to play about. You know what I'm saying? Y'all want to sit up and talk to folks and laugh and giggle and do all this until it's your folks. When your mama, when, if your mama go in that box and get put in that dirt, bitch, it's a problem then. When your family at risk and your income, your, your nephews and nieces, they got to grow up asking the motherfucker, why? What happened? They ain't gonna come look for no nigga that's supposed to been playing gangster in the club. They don't wanna talk to you. Where my uncle at? Uncle, what's going on? These niggas out here playing. Then get on the internet playing too. Nigga can't control my page, bro. If you don't like me or like what I'm saying, block the fuck out of me, bro. Block a nigga. That shit take two seconds. Block me. But I'm a man out here, bro. I don't care nothing about the police, the gang members. I don't care nothing about none of these niggas. I got to check in with nobody. Then no nigga check in with us when it was ugly. Nigga, from my understanding, nigga, everybody had a problem with a nigga. Nigga, when nobody fucking with a nigga, they been seeing a nigga doing views, doing numbers, and going hell. Niggas been doing that shit. I ain't no nigga never rest out. But now it's sweet and we on the other side. Now everybody fuck with you. Can't have my little brother around. He gonna be smash one of these niggas, fool. You heard me? He gonna be smash the nigga ass, fool. And I'm gonna do it out of the right way. I'm gonna do it the right way. Yeah. Everybody pull off. Leave. I got these. Get up out of here. You know what I'm saying? Put your own life on the line, nigga. Reach your own money. Reach your family. Reach your folks. Because this shit a domino effect. You ain't going to be getting them phone calls. I am. Hey, man, this shit backwards out here, bro. I don't understand, though. Niggas still want that. Niggas still want that clout. And when I get out there live, bro, this on God. I ain't gonna say this the last time I'm gonna go live. Cause if a nigga don't wanna call me and talk to me like a man and get no advice, then what I'm gonna do with it? Because it ain't only you that's walking around with this shit, bro. This shit connected, bro. You see what I'm saying? This shit gonna hurt a domino effect, bro. This shit gonna hurt down the line, bro. And, and all I wanna be able to say is I told you, bro. You know what I'm saying? You don't, you don't know how I feel for a nigga to post that shit and a nigga get on my get on my page talking about and me, your brother ain't fucking with you, nigga. What you doing? Why is you posting? Come on, cuz. We got the same mama, cuz. When they see me, they see dude. But it ain't even about him. I got a little brother. I got a little sister. I got cousins, aunties, a granddad, and my grandma dead. You see what I'm saying? Man, why you ain't around, bro? Why you ain't doing it? Bitch, I'm my own man. That what wrong with you niggas. And, and the only reason you want me to be around so you can see me uploads or do all that, don't none of that shit can supposed to even concern you for real. You see what I'm saying? Bro, when I was a young nigga, I ain't used to be around my brother like that, bro. When them niggas went on their missions and did what they did, them folks told me to go in the house. Young nigga, I'm talking about 12, 11, 13. Or go look through the window and see what they doing. See if we can go in there. That's all I had. Every time my brother moved around, he had my cousin with him. He had some more niggas with him. And every time a nigga do some phony ass, fake ass shit, or fuck around and crash the car, you want to come crying to me. 
Lil' bro, damn, bro, these niggas, man, these niggas this, that, and the other. You go to jail, who? You ain't got nobody to call, nigga. Who you gonna call? Man, bro, this shit, whoa, 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 whoa. So what we gonna do? We gonna prevent it? Or we gonna let this shit happen? You want me to stay quiet and not put nothing on your brain? Yeah, you gonna sleep on this. All I'm saying is, I ain't straight up, bro. I'm going to live my life, bro. My life on the line every day. And I don't get no fuck. I know how to control myself, bro. And if a nigga had a problem with me, bro, I'm going to prevent it, bro, before anything, bro. You see what I'm saying? It might not use to move around with me like that. All I really brought me around, he know I'm going to fight. He know I'm going to slam something. But now that I got a little old, I done been through something. I seen that the loyalty was a waste of time. And now I'm starting to come into my man, and you can't deal with it. You want to be able to say, I'm, I ain't, this shit going to go the way I want it to go. It ain't going no way. And you got that power because you got money. You got bread. But don't none of that shit move me. I knew I know you is. I knew what you were going to be. When mama in the kitchen cooking the spaghetti, and you on the table beating that hole. You hear me? I'm talking about hard. I am going to be rich one day. I ain't no we. If these bitch ass niggas keep on making these immature, lame ass decisions around this shit, a fight, even a fight, the fight is what's gonna get it done. Verbally, we'll get a nigga smoke. So if we can't control our mouth and our minds and our body, we on a crash dummy mission, bro. Finna crash, bro. I pray to God, bro, y'all get your man right, bro. And if you choose to keep on moving like that, and you know what I'm saying, you talking about this business and it ain't my motherfucker around you personally. I don't know these, they don't know none of these folk. But I understand business. So do what you got to do to get your money, take her, you and yours. I don't even like speaking on this shit, bro. Because I'm a man, bro, I handle my own business, bro. You know what I'm saying? I ain't mad. I ain't doing none of that. Everybody happy. Everybody free. Ain't no motherfucker dying. So I'm happy, bro. I got the opportunity to do what I need to do as a man, bro. But at the same time, bro, if that shit would have happened, y'all already know how I'm coming and how I feel about that, bro. I don't respect it, bro. Nah, fuck that, nigga. I done been locked in a cell, 90 degree weather, nigga. I don't get no fuck about being hot, nigga. Damn right I'm hot. And guess what? Ain't no nigga finna stop me from supporting my brother, loving my brother, because I realized that it ain't even about that, bro. You hear me? Nigga. Nigga, my family, they want to see us together. Nigga, they want to see us on the same page. It ain't me. It's who I am. To why a nigga can't. See what I'm saying? Come on, fool. Who you think, who you think hurt behind this shit when a motherfucker don't see us together? Or see us with each other? They don't just hurt the fans. Family and all that. But I realized this where my blessing is. Being a leader, being my own man, being in my own corner, having my own way of thinking, and you know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody finna move me. You see what I'm saying? And I'm cool with that. You hear me? I love the bottom. I love the mud. And I'm still shining when I come out of it. I'm shining. These bitches love me. You hear me? 3,500 views and shit like that on my stories and shit. Nothing but bad bitches, you hear me? I be scrolling, looking. You know what I'm saying? Man, hey, Jerome, oh, God, fuck with these folks saying. Real talk. You got to have some type of curve for people, bro. But my brother, he in survival mode, bro. Nigga seen himself like getting rich and got his freedom took I don't blame him. 
He got his freedom took away from him. He got niggas that's threatening his life. They want to kill him and niggas really plotting on this man. Dude is like something you ain't never seen before, bro. That's all them stressing, man. Dude, the greatest, bro. My brother, the greatest nigga, bro. I'd be damned if I lose that man, bro. Then don't let me lose somebody. <sighs> Give a fuck how hard you is, nigga. That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt you. That's gonna hurt you, man. So think about everything you do and how you move. Because as long as I ain't third and I'm living, this is the way I can touch you. This is the way I can tell you how I feel. And when I get off this shit, I'm back promoting. I'm back on some F and G shit. You heard me. I don't, come on, man. I ain't getting into all that, bro. But everybody, every motherfucker that, that, that get on this hoe want to play and want to Laugh about this shit. It's the internet, bro. They what they supposed to do. I ain't mad at them. Have a ball. You don't like me? Have a ball, bro. You see this polo swell of this hoe? Like that. You hear me? Bitch want to hug me right now. Damn, I want to hug the shit out of him right now. I know it. I know it. I got to get my attitude up, man. I got to I gotta fuck around, man. You know what I'm saying? All these niggas that be crashed, fucked around and crashed the car, where they at now? They ain't nowhere to be found. They got a whole new circle. But your motherfucking family, I don't give a fuck how mad you get at them. You gonna have to see them again. You hear me? You gonna have to see them again. And I realize once I get mad about something and I spaz out and I'm fucked up about it, it's cool, it's okay. I'm gonna go give me some rest, take me a good shower. I'm gonna go lay down, I'm gonna think this shit off. Once I go to sleep and I wake up the next day, that shit gonna be gone, bro. I'm gonna feel totally different. I'm tired of apologizing. I'm sorry for this. I'm, I'm sorry if I was wrong because I did this. I ain't sorry no more. You don't like how, fuck you. I'm a man, bro. So I'm going to cool down, get myself together, pick up, and I still got the hustle. I still got people to look out for. If something go down or something like that, I'm the nigga that's on hand. I ain't sending no money. I'm pulling up, jumping out. What the problem is? My life on the line all day. I don't get my, hey, bro, they go such and such. I don't give a fuck what's going on. If it's meant to go there, we finna go there. If it ain't, we finna roll, man. So, man, take all the clout. Take, take, the, take the gangster route. All I'm saying is, when it come to me, don't address me on it. Don't talk to me about it. I said everything I had to say. I wish the best for my brother and everybody that's with him. I hope all y'all niggas, I didn't get on here and say, I got a problem with y'all being there. I said, have the right type of mindset around my brother and my fucking family, bro. Because if you bitches around on some groupie shit, and y'all scared to tell two times what he wrong get, because you scared you got to go home and can't smoke big wood, you a bitch. Period, bro. I ain't on reacting. I ain't saying nothing wicked. I ain't on reacting. This shit real life, bro. I'm speaking my mind for real. This ain't no entertainment. None of that shit, bro. You want to stay around some shit that bad to the point where you can't speak up for yourself and tell a nigga what's right so this shit won't go wrong? You not, though. Because you don't care. You probably low-key don't like him anyway. You mad looking at him upside his head, but when the pictures getting too cute, put your bitch ass on. You don't like him. I know you don't. You don't understand him. Man, I love my brother to the core, bro. I understand shit he do. Some shit I don't understand. But I go back to understand that he's mad fucked up, bro. I wouldn't have been surprised if he crashed out in that hole, bro. I wouldn't have been surprised. 
Ain't no telling what dude will do. But when he makes his decision and you see it in his face and he get mad, go at him, bro. If he cut you off and send you home, let that be the let that be what it be. And let whatever happened happen on his own time.